Hello everybody. Today we're going to see how I draw Mech Axe. All right, I'm going to start off with a quick sketch for myself. And then I'll switch over to Sharpie, so don't worry if you can't see it. This is all about me right now. This is just to make sure that I don't fall off the page and that I have everything in here. So, don't worry about what you can't see because we're about to all play together in the pool of drawing. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, uh, let's see. I like where I'm going with this. I'm gonna bring that up a little bit more. Do that. This is going to come over here, round it off, point that, make that a jiggity jaggedy, make this up, put that over, a little mohawkity, like that, and I think I am ready. All right, I'm going to use a, uh, a straight edge, a ruler, basically, for um, this, the staff. So if you want to go get one, you can. I uh, just want to uh, prepare you now. So I'm going to switch over. I'm, I'm happy with this. So I'm going to switch over to a Sharpie and use uh, a couple other Sharpies too. Sharpie, a couple of Sharpie pens. This one says medium. This is actually a little thicker than this one. So you'll see what I'm going to do. Just some fun little uh, um, highlights. That's the word I'm looking for. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with this whole thing, then we'll work on the, the staff in a second, okay? So let's go ahead and start with the arc right here. So we're gonna come down from this point, then kind of arc it down to a little bit of a, of a round point, not quite a point, um, just round it off, okay? So we're gonna bring it back up here like this, gonna swoop in a little bit, go back up and swoop it down. Okay, so then we're going to connect this like that, or not connect because we're just extending out. We're just going to draw that, then I'm going to arc that back up here, a little bit higher, about to that point. And then this is going to come down to here. Okay, then angle that back a little bit, go straight, and then connect it. So you should have something that looks kind of like that. If not, that's okay. Yours looks awesome too. So now I'm going to, I'm going to add the top of the hat. I don't know why I think it's a head like this, and then I'm gonna add a mohawkity, which is basically gonna come a line to a point like this, another line to a point like this, and then I'm gonna connect them right there. So we're gonna mohawkity point like that, mohawkity point like this, and we're on our way, okay? So I need to draw a circle right here, and I should use a, uh, a template, but I'm not going to, we're just gonna eyeball it, right? Because that's what the rest of this is. Not too bad. How's yours look? Awesome. Okay, so let's add the bottom of his mouth. I know it's not a face, but it just looks like one to me. Then round it up like this. Then I'm gonna add a, a, a pointily, wantily, what did I call that? Uh, yeah, that, that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna come down here like this, and I'm gonna come back here like that to a point. Looks almost like a rocket ship, I guess, too, huh? And then from here, I'm gonna go to this point. Cool. So now we're gonna get close to the staff. So I'm going to draw a tiny little line like this. And of course it's connected. So I'm gonna come down a little bit and angle it back like that. Then I'm gonna basically do the same thing. So I'm gonna come over here and curve it around and then down and like that. And here's where we're gonna draw our staff. Now, I drew a couple of lines for, because I'm gonna have it uh, jig jag a little bit, okay? So I know that it's gonna, th these edges are gonna stick out more than this middle part that's gonna kinda go in. So it's not like that on the front, it's just like that on the back, but I thought it was a cool uh, um, feature that I wanted to stick with. And so I'm basically gonna do something like this. Like that, okay? Then I'm gonna come in here and I'm going to just just a hair in, just barely. I'm going to fill in that spot, but not connect them. Just kind of do like that. So see how it's in just a little bit? Doesn't matter if you do that. I just thought it was cool, so I thought I'd, I'd add that, you know? 
So my staff is a little thick, so I'm gonna thicken it or, or thin it up like this and just draw a line to the other side. And so, since that's the case, I'm just going to just connect it like that. That's okay, no big deal. It looks a little fuzzy because my, my Sharpie is bleeding. That's all right, no big deal. So now I'm just gonna draw this edge and draw the bottom part, which is like that. Bring this to a point, bring it up to a whippity point like this, then bring it out to a backity point like that, and we're good there. So now I'm just gonna add just a few little uh, highlights, right? So that's gonna be the obvious one, but we'll do that last. This has kind of a, a weird jiggity jag. That's what it was, that was a jiggity jag. A weird jiggity line that's like this, but it's like a tech line is really what it is. It's not really weird or, or jiggity. It's just, uh, you know, where, where parts were put together is what that is. And there's a couple more lines like this and all the way to the back. There's another one here. It's going to come down, go all the way to the point like this. All right. And so the last few things we're going to do are uh, the, the lines I was doing. So I'm going to kind of connect it here since they didn't really connect. All right. And that'll give me a point to draw like this. So see, nothing too crazy, but it stands out. Now it looks a little different, you know? And there is kind of a, a handle down here on this end. So I'm going to go ahead and just draw some uh, lines to simulate the, uh, the texture that they have in their skin. Okay. All right, so I'm going to take care of the rest with color. So that is Mech X. So here is my colored version. You could do it however you like. I just thought I'd show you how I decided to color it. If you'd like to color it like this, you can always pause the video here and use the coloring techniques that I used, or you can just make it your own. Remember, this is how I draw. You draw how you draw. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more adventures of how I draw. Plus, don't forget to hit that notification button to be updated about each new video.